You probably saw this statistic last week in the news where Microsoft announced that around 30% of their production code is already being developed by AI. And we're seeing more big tech companies using a similar OKR. Google, Amazon, even Meta recently released that they expect to have around 50% of the production code generated by AI next year. All of this movement started at a very high level, mostly by CEOs creating these AI memos. But that's not enough because that doesn't really drive behavioral change. When you hear your CEO say, you have to do more with less, how do you action that? Well, now we're seeing what that really means. We're seeing more and more organizations using OKRs at the company-wide level to increase AI adoption. The example I just gave you is very, very common in engineering. If you think about similar examples for product teams, we could look at number of tickets being closed without human interaction. You could look at the velocity of your sprints or how that velocity is being accelerated. So we expect to see much more of that. I think the point of putting it at the company-wide level and defining a measurable OKR so people know what to aim for, it's very important to drive that type of behavioral change.